Hello everyone, it's me, Gemma, and I love Game of Thrones. I'm loving it. I've read all the books and I've watched all the TV shows and I'm in love with Jon Snow. So I'm gonna make some cupcakes with the family sigils of some of my favorite families. So, I've iced some cupcakes with the kind of muted colors um, because I think they're gonna go really nicely with the bright flaggy colors. And I've made some kind of shieldy shapes, almost like little shields or little flags, um, in various different colours and I'm going to pipe straight onto those. So I've got some um, ivory kind of colour modelling paste which is sugar paste and a bit of gum tragacanth mixed in to make it a bit firmer and I'm just going to roll that out with my rolling pin until it's about four millimetres thick and then I'm just going to get a big circular cutter and chomp a big old circle out. And then to make my um, flaggy shieldy shape, I'm going to chop the sides and the top off and then make a little V, like so. Right, so there's my little flaggy thing and I'm going to pipe directly onto it with royal icing. So what I've done is I've made a couple of mood boards. So I've got all my favourite houses and I've got all my Google images and I put them on a bit of paper and then looked at them and made a list of all the colours that I'd need to make up with my royal icing. Right, so I've got um, a 1.5 nozzle in my piping bag here with my black royal icing and I'm going to use that to make that outline of the dire wolf for House Stark. So I'm going to start by trying to visualise on my little picture of my dire wolf where it needs to be in position on my little shield flaggy thing. So I think I'm going to start on his top tuft, <laughs> on the top of his head, because that's kind of in the middle. So here it goes. I feel so tense right now. Right. So that's my outline done, as you can see. When you fill things with um, royal icing, you've got to remember that royal icing dries really, really hard, and so any lines that you've made are in danger of getting knocked off and cracked and stuff. So when you fill gaps in, just be really, really gentle with where you're poking your little muzzle. Here it goes. Right, so now it just needs teeth and an eye, and then it's finished. Okay, so that's done. And all I need to do now is put him on a cake. And I think I'm gonna put him on a blue cake. I think that'll look really nice. So I'm just gonna get a bit of royal icing, actually. And then just pop it straight on, right in the middle. Right, so that's Stark done. I'm just going to do some more now. Right, my last one, Targaryen. Right, so that's them all done. Perfect for, you know, a party or a red wedding or something. 
And if you like this video and you want to see more videos by me, then don't forget to click the link to subscribe. Um, you know nothing, Jon Snow. <laughs>